Hi, my name is Nicolas Ledort, and I'm the System Engineering Manager for Time of Flight at Analog Devices. I would like to tell you about our newest developments in the area of CMOS-based Time of Flight Imaging Solutions. Analog Devices has partnered with Microsoft to bring their state-of-the-art 3D Time of Flight technology to an electronic gadget near you. Time of flight sensors allow computers, or really any piece of hardware, to perceive depths, and with ADI's technology to do it in the highest resolution and most accurate way possible. For example, the soundbar in your home, your thermostat, smart speaker, security system, or other gadget can effectively be given the sense of sight. This enables things like new ways of interacting with these devices through gestures. Or you might envision these devices working together to keep track of where you are in your home and then to tune your HVAC or your audio appropriately. ADI recently released the 1 megapixel imager, the ADSD 3100, as well as our software based depth compute engine. The ADSD 3100 offers the smallest pixel size and highest modulation frequency on the market, allowing customers to achieve the most accurate and lowest noise depth images for a given power consumption and ambient illumination. Layered on top, we also offer a proprietary depth computation software stack that allows customers to make optimal use of our hardware in achieving industry-leading accuracy. The depth engine is optimized for use on the Qualcomm Snapdragon 865 and Exagon DSP, as well as the NXP IMX8 platform to give optimum performance and ease of integration. Here we demonstrate how time-of-flight sensors can be used in people tracking applications. By leveraging the depth information, the people tracking algorithm complexity and computational burden can be significantly reduced as compared to traditional computer vision algorithms that leverage stereo cameras and other methods. Being able to identify the occupants of a given room can be used in a number of scenarios, ranging from building automation and people counting. Optimizing their experience, as already mentioned, for things like audio and climate control. We can also monitor their well-being. You can see how the algorithm is able to detect a person that has fallen. This type of information could prove critical for remote monitoring or assisted living facilities. Lastly, by identifying the occupants, a safety cage or safety bubble can be created, ensuring proper social distancing. Now, you may not want to socially distance at home, but this application can prove critical in work settings or the factory floors while collaborative robots are working hand-in-hand -hand with humans. The possibilities are quite limitless for this new technology, and we encourage you to come take a closer look by visiting analog.com slash TOF. Thank you for watching.